I can't tell you how pleased I am with you, Mr. Garrett. I simply can't find the words. But perhaps Victoria can help me in that regard. She has such a way with them. Yes, we are both so very pleased. Victoria? Even though the eye is defective. What? Victoria is quite right, Mr. Garrett. I don't mean to sound ungrateful, but this eye is completely blind. It's a rock. It's what you asked for. Am I going to get paid or not? Of course. Victoria, are you prepared to give Mr. Garrett his compensation? Bow to the woodsy lord and offer up your flesh eyes so that his eye of stone may see, man fool. Bids he then the spruces to sing her him an anthems, and the woodsy lord binders them fleshes to stone. Did you think those ancient phrases were mere words, man fool? Look at me! I am the Woodsy Lord, the trickster of legend. If you be thirsty, flesh thing, drink of me. If you be hungry, then feed, for I am the honey maker and the jumpsberry. He am the leaf that feeders on the fleshed ones. Them that calls themselves builders and wielded up a hammers against him. My poor Mr. Garrett, you will not live to see the sprawling glory of it. Your sacrifice is not yet complete. Nine lilacs and nine thistlebades must feed and die. Stands he then in the greens and festive maw and speeds he of his judgments upon the weeps and writhing man folks. stone rolling downhill. Now you must aim this remarkable momentum. It is past time for the balance to shift. They come. What? Wait! The trickster will not forgive you for doing what he could not. Nor I trust will you forgive us. Keepers. Looks like I better get moving or whatever those things are will waste a perfectly good rescue.
for me now!
Mother would see! Ah! <laughs> 
these bills. Be gone! <laughs> Die, sneak! Oh, <laughs>